smell burning? Right here? Uh, I did oh, think yeah, I... Oh, yeah, little... Almost like a plasticky... It keeps coming and going right in this little area here. Hmm. Ella? Did you feel the... Yeah, like a... That was her bedroom over there. We should go to the next room over. Yes. We can't ignore that. No. This is where Ellen Miller was bleeding out during childbirth. And this is where they found the blood and the floorboards. I have the ionizer. We can ionize the atmosphere. Let's do it. Let's do it. Ella Miller, are you here with us? It's here. Oh, yeah? That smell, I don't know what it is. It's like... Yeah? Oh, wow. Yeah. What is that? Could that be the smell of, like, lamp oil or something that they would use? I don't know what's going on. I don't know what it is. Wow, again. Really? Holy smokes. It's just coming out of nowhere. I don't usually put too much into phantom smell, but it's strange, man. It keeps coming and going. If that's you trying to get our attention, you have our attention. This is Daylin, Juwan, and Marcus in the drawing room. So we have these claims of hearing voices, people seeing children up here. Mm -hmm. I'm turn that I'm off. Turn it off. It's not just, you know. Did y'all hear that? What'd you hear? That was like a knock or something over here. Bro, I'm not going front, man. What? This this just feels like wrong. You just don't walk into nobody's bedroom at this hour. You don't try to do a spirit box in here? Yeah. Margaret Lanner has it. Feel free to sit down and have a conversation with the Ghost Brothers. Was this your bedroom? Do you want us to leave? I, I thought it said three of them. So listen, when I first ask, is this your room? Somebody immediately says no. Then you hear a man say, get out. Then you hear a woman say, I can't. And it says it's three of them. So listen for those key things. No. Do you want us to leave? I did hear that Oh, snap. I think they're talking about us get out or her get out, because the way that it made it sound like she was responding like, I can't get out. Right. Let's keep running it. Is that the rim pod? You cut that off. Bro, it is off. Oh my God. Bro, it is off. Let me see. That's crazy, yeah. bro. We walk into a domestic situation we're not supposed to be a part of, and then you hear the REM pod out here. So obviously, let's distract them from what's going on in there. But the REM pod was off, Juwan. But you turned the REM pod off, so like, where we at? If we knock again, can you knock back to us? Ooh. Weird. Sounds like somebody's hitting a pillow. It was like a... No. Nothing sounds like it. Is anyone here from the Sayer family? Robert Sayer? Stan, all right, that was a knock, but there was a noise in here. Really? Now there's nothing. It's only happening when we're asking something. Somebody was trying to talk to us through these rapping sounds, and we'd love to figure out who that is. 
Do you know who Mr. Sayer is? Robert Sayer? I mean, that was intelligent. There's absolutely no knock until you ask a question. I'm gonna see if maybe I can locate that source. That'd be great. Like, I can use this thermal IR detector that at least tell us if there's a mass here that has a different temperature than we do. Robert Sayer, are you here? Are you willing to talk with us? That was a knock. Robert Sayer, we're looking for you. Just. Oh, what the hell's going on? It's picking up a heat signature? Sure am, right here. This is Dave and Dustin. We're in the attic. This is where someone was grabbed, and also they hear children's voices. Is there anybody up here with us? People say they can hear you talking sometimes up here. I heard what sounded like a little girl. Just now? Yeah. Tango 2 Taps Van. This is Taps Van. Do you hear or see any children outside? Or anything that could be interpreted as sounding like a child? I haven't heard anything. Copy, thank you. I'm going to play back that audio. OK. Whoa, <laughs> dude, that's great. <laughs> Incredible. Wow, that is so great. Incredible. Yeah. Do you go upstairs at all? Does that person come downstairs at all? What the hell was that sound? Oh, you're seeing. What? Oh, there was just weird, like, I don't know if it was a humming, or it was like a weird, like, hmm. Huh. Is that humming noise coming from whoever is upstairs? The thumping. It's just a bump. Yeah. Yeah, bump. It stopped. The humming's totally stopped. It sounds like a child's voice, and they hear children's voices. You playing hide and seek up here in the attic? When I was a child, I'd play in the attic. This is a great place to play. Talk to us again. Tell Dave your name. What do you think? Maybe we should move along. Yeah. What is that? What is going on? It sounded like a male voice. 1046. All right. Dude, that sounds like a grumpy man. What the heck? Dude, this place is crazy. The fact that we've got three different voices, a male voice, a young girl's voice, and that sounds like an old man. Margarita, are you here? What happened to you? Look, look. What is moving up there, man? Look at it. There's it's illuminated. Yeah. Wow. It's pulsating. Yeah. What's going on in there? Wow. Steve Tutango. Tango for Steve. Can you check on the monitors to confirm an anomalous light we're seeing in the arena? On my way. You have to check it out right you now. 
We can't stay down there and just assume it's something paranormal. Absolutely. Can I go for Steve? Go for Steve. Okay, I see you guys walking up the stairs there. Thanks, man. There are some windows up there. I, I see the windows on the top. I'm seeing some light in that room. Can you tell if it's coming from a source or if it's just an illumination of some sort? I can't tell. It is pretty distant. The camera, it's more of a glow. I'm gonna go check it out now. Copy that, yeah. I mean, that's a claim. There, too. They say they can see lights. If it's something paranormal, it would have to be energy, so a glowing ball of light, or an actual ethereal apparition. I don't know. Okay, the control room. I really don't see anything in here that's gonna explain that illumination. There's no outside windows. I don't see any fluctuation. Hmm. If this wasn't a room full of electronics, we could try to get some sensory equipment going, but... Yeah, crazy readings. Right. Is there anyone here with us? This is wild, man. I, I really don't know how to explain what we saw with the light. I mean, neither. Yeah. 